coming up on Fish Addictions, Whatever It Takes. Oh, I'm living now. Oh, I'm gonna camp this weekend. Upgrade city for the game. Do <laughs> This season, six guys, three teams, doing whatever it takes to catch the biggest three of 13 species in 16 weeks. This is whatever it takes. Yeah! Yeah! Look at that thing! Bada bing, bada boom! Yeah! <laughs> That's a good in. <laughs> that thing's fat! Oh, now it's a part. Another night in the life of the fish addictions, guys. Coming into this episode, Team Step Cousins and Team Bearded Buddies are tied for the top spot, and Team Grease Siders is close behind. But one catch can change everything. Well, we had a bit more snow. Uh, next trip here, we got planned with the boys. We're gonna take a little, take a little adventure over to the Elbow Lake area. There's a lot of, a lot of backwood gems in there. A lot of good lakes that uh, hold some crappies, some bluegills. We're uh, we're taking the sleds. We're going trail riding. We're gonna be going through the trails. As you can see on the live scope, I'm in about eight feet of water here, and these fish are just cruising. There's Tim is set up over in probably about 12, 14 feet of water, something like that, and Jay's over there too, and they're just cruising this weed edge. They're so aggressive. Got it. Trout. Holy cow, settle down buddy, settle down. Cool. Oh, so cool. Oh. Dip him. Dip him in the water so you can see him. Nice with the camera here. Trout ski. Woo! All right, I gotta get my bump board, measure him. All right, bump board in play. Mouth closed. 12 and a quarter. 12 and a quarter inch rainbow trout. Woo! Oh, that was so cool. There's three of them down there fighting over the bait. Stream trout, we're on the board, baby. Uh, look at Taylor call and see if he'll answer. El Cumpanero, what's up? <laughs> what's up, partner? Oh, you know. Out here looking for the Steelies. Steelies? Yeah, I just caught a rainbow. What? Yeah, you didn't see it in the group message? No, that was you? Yeah, I just I just caught a 12 and a quarter inch rainbow. <laughs> no kidding, where the hell are you? Uh, I'm over in an undisclosed location. Oh, nice. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, we had, we took about a, oh, about a 12 mile snowmobile ride out here this morning. We're in the weeds. We are in the woods. Well, I'm headed to the woods. A lot of uncharted territory is what we're in today. Are you going uh, to Lake of the Woods? Oh, nice, dude. Yeah, so I'm gonna camp this weekend. That a boy. Well, yeah, get after them burbs, man. Yeah, got up open. Uh, burbs, sauger, like... big walleye. There's nobody really out there quite yet. Yeah. We'll see when I get there. Okay, sounds good, dude. Awesome. Keep me posted. Uh, awesome, will do. Thanks, buddy. Later. Scotty brought out the creme de la creme. <laughs> the upper echelon top shelf pop tart, baby. The wild berry. <laughs> <laughs> the only kind you should buy right here. Absolute sweetness. Mmm. Oh. Wild berry, baby. I'm ready to just sit on the couch and watch the Jetsons. Oh. Dude, this is so good. Oh. This place is just freaking majestic. Not a trail. Fresh snow, catching trout. Sorry, really bad. 
really bad camera angle here. <laughs> Trying to get this trout up. Nice. Oh, it's a beauty. Oh, it's a beauty. Oh, it's a beauty. Oh, wow. Oh, man. That's the biggest one I've caught today. But it is a freak show when it comes to these fish. Oh, man, these are so much fun to catch. On that little plastic, a little spug. Oh, nice. Nice. We're gonna go 14. 14 incher. Yep, mouth closed. 14 inches. Yes! Oh, I got a good one. Ooh, dandy. Dandy crappie. from the trout lake now we're on the crappie lake 13 and three quarter on the bump on the bump 13 and three quarter inch crappie good start fellas just a chunky one too let's catch another dude there's some donkeys down here yeah I went right down and bam there's like a crib here or something it's a really weird looking crib. Oh! Wait, 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 wait. Yeah! <laughs> Boom, baby! Yeah. Woo! Shazam! I don't even have to catch him. I'm having fun just watching him catch him. Oh, dude, it's 14. 14 inch crappie. Woo -hoo! Yeah, buddy! Bingo! Send it on the group chat! Oh, I'm living now! Oh, two drops, two fish! So, uh, just got set up and fishing here uh, in 29 feet of water. Uh, I'm starting off with a dead stick on one and a jigging rod on the other. Uh, while I was setting up, I had the Garmin down there, but I didn't have down there yet, and I had a fish swim underneath me, so that's a good sign that uh, there's activity around. This is where I'm going to be for the next couple days, so stick with me. Oh, hey, 6.30 at night. I just had something screaming up high, like 10 feet off the ice. And I reeled up and I got it to turn. And I got it to play around a little bit. And I just dumped it. Oh. It's still there. Come on. Turn around. Turn around. I see you. Come on, give me another crack. Yes! Yeah! <laughs> yes! Absolutely yes! Dude! Upgrade city for the game! Look at this thing! <laughs> oh my goodness! I can't believe it gave me another shot! This is why I'm staying overnight! Oh, walleye! Walleye, how I love you! Oh, how I love you! Son of a... Biscuit. God, I love this lake for this exact reason. I don't come here often enough. I really don't. But this is the exact reason why a guy comes here and why you stay the way we're doing this here. That doesn't happen very often. They don't turn around very often. I think we touched 26 on this one. So that's, that's touching there. We get 26. <laughs> we 
That's a dandy. Yes. It's going to be that time of night where I can only really want to pay attention to one bobber. So I'm going to annoyingly throw this bad boy down. Got my line set. Should be good. Get some noise making happen. Fish. Good sign. Good sign. Hopefully this light stays on. Yes. 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 <laughs> Absolutely what I wanted. So pretty. And they're good eats. I gotta get this on the board here before my light goes out so I can change batteries. But yes. Pumped. Pumped, pumped, pumped. I don't know how, how good this looks. Get this slimy son of a biscuit. 20 and a quarter. <laughs> I don't know how I'm gonna straighten this out by myself here, but 20 and a quarter. Ah. <laughs> oh, this is fun. Nasty. So 20 and a quarter, guys. I know it's not, I don't know how else to do this here. I mean, she rolls out 20 and a quarter, boys. Whoop! We're gearing up. Day two. Hitching and riding. <clears throat> the boys are getting the carbon out of the skis right now. We're making it smoky in here. We have no wind. It's not like yesterday. Yesterday was windy. So we were in the shelter a little bit yesterday, but today is going to be all outdoor fishing. Well, it's going to be a good day. It's going to be sunny, 30, no wind. Should be, should be enjoyable. Bluegills, crappies, maybe a largemouth bass. See if we can't get an upgrade here. We'll see what's in store. I think I got a bass. Yes, sir. Little bass. 15. 15 inch bass. 15 inch Another burb. Oh my. 23. That's a believable 23. <laughs> I'm going with it. I'm risking it. I'm going with it. You guys can believe me. Dock me. I'm not going to fight this guy anymore. Sorry, whoopsie on this, but I'm going to have to measure this for an upgrade. The camera didn't turn on while I was reeling. So I'm going to throw this thing on a measurement here. Oh, you're a good one. I'm gonna go 15 and a half. Close mouth. Oh, easy. Easy. Yeah, 15 and a half. Awesome. I'm super curious what this is gonna be. It took off running and almost ripped my rod right out of the, right out of the stand here. Oh, that's a big old perch, dude. <laughs> Holy tanker! Ah, the perch I've seen up here for myself have all been small. So we got an upgrade here. So I'm gonna set this down. Easy turbo. Just kissing the line. Twelve. Yahtzee. Upgrade, 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 upgrade. Pro tip, uh, a lot of the year frozen shiners really work well, but this time of year live shiners seem to be better, but as they're not 
a very particularly hardy minnow. I was told by the bait store owner to throw in snow. Every time it melts, just throw another handful of snow or ice or slush or whatever in there and it keeps them alive. Uh, for the amount of scoops that I got, and I have been keeping up, these are how many I've had perish. Now, pro pro tip, I'm gonna keep these and add them to my bag of frozen shiners and just keep freezing them and that way I'm not actually wasting them and they will come in handy next time I need frozen shiners. Look at this old boy. What do we go here? We get you 12. Do we get you a quarter? We get you a quarter. Just touching the line. Quarter touching the line. Yeah, so look how fat this fish is, hey. He almost ripped my rod right out of the, right out of this thing, and I had the reel, I had the reel sitting in the hole, and this thing started to pull, like, like it just started to pull this way, and the, I mean that bobber was gone, and it was immediate. He hit it and ran, sucker. Excellent. All right, the upgrade. Oh, yo. <laughs> Got a decent hole here in front of my heater. So it's at least a 14. Nose touched. Tail pinched. We get quarter. We get a 14 and a quarter. That's an upgrade. Upgrade. It's a good fish. Well, here we go. Trying this. We're gonna try and get a measurement. This is really flat. Ooh, fatty. What we got here? Nope, 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 nope. We're gonna go that way. We're going this way. Let's turn it around. Let's go back that way. Oh, I got 24. Yep, 24. 24 and a quarter. 24 and a quarter. I can't believe this thing's sitting still like that. Hey guys, just checking in with you. We're on our way up the Lake of the Woods trying to get some tulabies and maybe a few pike, you know, a little bit of everything up there, but really concentrating on trying to get a few tulabi on the board. I think that's going to be one of the, I don't want to say the tougher ones, but Lake of the Woods has definitely some of the bigger ones. So hopefully get those scratched off the board or get a couple good ones at least. Uh, I got my buddy Olive with. She's excited to go fishing. Uh, we're going to stay the night on the ice and out in the snow bear and uh, we're going to be way out in the middle. Uh, yeah, so uh, that's the plan. Tulis, pike, maybe a few walleyes and saugers always mixed in. Uh, see what we can do. So that's our plan. Hey, welcome to the shack. Are we fishing? <laughs> Back up and then just get out. Woo! Tule! On the board! Tungsten on Lake of the Woods. <laughs> there we go. Let's see how big it is. Gonna get it on the board. 13 and a half. Are we gonna get? 13 and a quarter. 13 and a quarter. Okay, release. Oh, you stay. Good job, Olive. High five. High five. Hey, hey. High five. Hey. She's like, get that thing out of my spot. Okay, now come on. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Ooh, another toolie. Come here. Yeah! <laughs> what do you think, Ollie? That's a little bit bigger one. Oh, not on my seat. That one wanted the dead stick. It's been a long time since I've got a tool. Dead stick, alright. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh! 15 incher. Nose touching. Touching 15 inches. 15 inch toolie. What is that? What is that? Huh? What is it? Hey, is that Tuli? Is that what we're after? Is that what we came for? Yeah. 
Should we let it go? Alright. Two! That's a good sauger. Okay, that was unexpected. Man, this being by yourself thing is a lot tougher than a guy thinks. Got it. Sog dog. All right, let's see. Oh boy, I thought it was better. Oh, 14 and a quarter inch. We'll take it, we'll take it. Well, close. 14 and a quarter, 14 and a quarter. 14 and a quarter. 14 and a quarter sauger. That's an upgrade, so we'll take it. Well, good morning from day three here. There's a good possibility that I can upgrade on perch again, so I might stick around for that. I don't know what this is, but it's got some snort to it. It feels like an upgrade fish. Definitely feels like an upgrade fish. Unless it's a walleye. It's an upgrade walleye. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. <laughs> yes! Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that at all. I thought maybe like bigger perch. This thing didn't have any fight until it got close. Let's see what we got here. Nose. Stay, stay steady, baby. 23. Back to the nose. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, swim away, young lady. Turn. Bye bye wave. Gotta love it. Hell yeah! Upgrade! Upgrade! Lay down, on your blanket. Go on. Come on. Be a decent pike. I'm okay with a decent pike. There's three of them. That's just kind of a weird thing. I don't even know where I got them. He's pulled out more line than I've taken back from him. Where's he at? Oh, it's a giant, guys. It's a giant. It's a good one. Come on, buddy. This is a tough one to land by yourself. I can tell you that for sure. Come on, come on. Get your head up. Oh! No! <laughs> That'll work for a starter. There's a couple of them down there. I've never seen pike come through. Like, look at that, Olive. Oh, that is crazy by yourself. 36 inch pike. 36. 36 inch pike. Yeah. Wild ride on walleye gear. Wow. And they're, it's weird because they're showing up two, three at a time. I've never seen, I've never seen Pike do that. Ever. Come on, buddy. I haven't really got a good chance to see exactly what I'm dealing with here. Just when they got a rip and wrap it on the 
Another good pike, really. Need to set the board up, but here you go. There you go. <laughs> Fishing toolies. Catch a pike. Let's see this. Yeah. On board. Thirty-six. Thirty-six easy. Thirty-six easy. Well. Two good pike, not giants, but 36 inches, nothing to shake your head at. So two in the day, fishing toolies. They gotta be down here just feeding on these toolies. Yesterday, there was quite a few toolies around here. Came back today to try to get one more. And the toolies are agitated. They're going, they're, there's a lot of big pike down there. So see ya. You know, this game kind of makes every fish count. So I don't think 36, 236 is gonna hold up in the end, but maybe we'll need one of those. Maybe we'll get a 40, 43, and that 36 will end up being a big deal. So here we go. You'll never believe this. Hooked up, trying to get a toolie in here, trying to put the camera back in place so you guys can see me catching this toolie. I literally put this pike down. First fish that shows up is a massive <laughs> That's a great fish. What? <laughs> That's what we're here for. Take the pike out of the system and the two leaves will happen. Holy macro. That's a good one. That's a good one, boys and girls. Excited. He didn't even wait. Like, I didn't even get the camera set back up. Threw it down there. Ripped it up. Big Tooley. All right, let's make it. 16 and a half inch too late yeah 16 and a half inch toolie that's a that's a good one that's a really really good one like that's 15 i was happy with yesterday 16 and a half we'll take it that's gonna be hard to beat i wanted to get three toolies they've been a little bit harder to come by so 16 and a half inch toolie going back i got just take a second after that a couple things i am disgusting i have tule slime and pike slime all over me my board is nasty pike slime and tule slime it reeks but it's a great smell <laughs> that was pure chaos oh that's it for us up the lake of the woods we all of and i did an overnight uh bounced around a lot didn't catch a lot of fish but weren't expecting to catch a lot of fish so uh got some toolies got some pike and uh yeah i'm happy where it went i upgraded one sauger as well uh lake of the woods is a special place people there's a lot of places a lot of different fish you can catch and this isn't gonna be the last time you see us up here so every fish counts every one we don't know where we're gonna end up at the end of the season uh, all of us have caught a ton of big fish we know where big fish are we can all catch big fish but putting 13 species of three of the biggest of each of those species that you can on the board that's a tough task to do and we're finding that out as each week goes by and where we're at but i think we're doing fairly well so hope you guys are enjoying all these episodes uh let us know your feedback because we're having a lot of fun doing it and i hope it's getting portrayed that way uh yeah all of back on the screen too everybody's been asking she's back Holy cow, look at those grease siders go worst to first in just one episode. Giant eight point week for them. I think they stole a few points. They definitely gained a few. It's, we're coming down to the wire here. We got a month of fishing left. And this is getting crazy. The scores are just flip flopping. They're getting tight. The scoreboard's filling up. Just thin margins between the teams. This is gonna get crazy. After an excellent ice camping trip and outing to Elbow Lake, Team Grease Siders has taken a commanding lead over Team Bearded Buddies, while Team Step Cousins has returned to third place. Come back next week to see if this new leader will stay in position.
next time on Fish Addictions, Whatever It Takes. This is mentally exhausting. Yeah, buddy. This is exactly why I'm here. Evan, did you have fun? Yeah! Thank you for watching Fish Addictions, Whatever It Takes. Follow us on Facebook and Instagram at Fish Addictions. And be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel.